very strong squeeze muscles, they tell me. <laughs> She's got a cyst here that's a little annoying. It's a little tough sometimes on the chest because I want to try to make this as small as possible. Make sure I'm never hurting you, of course. But I've also got to be able to put this suture in afterwards. So let's see if we can't just pull it out. You're okay, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. strong squeeze muscles they tell me. <laughs> you know what I realized? I think I might even need a little add to this one. Let's try it and see. This isn't too big. This forceps here. I'm never hurting you. Stop cool here. You okay, huh? Mm -hmm. Okay. I'm like, I'm just to gross you out, scooping out the contents, but I'm <laughs> trying to get the sack wall. Because the issue is, if you don't get it all, it can grow back. But the challenge again is getting it out of the small area here. I think I'm gonna let's see if I can get that now. Gosh. You know what? Give me a little aspirin if you don't mind. Thank you. <laughs> The ads in that I just got is helping enormously. Almost had it all. Looks pretty good. Alright, tap that one lightly. Like I try to sneak up on it or something. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then the next challenge for me is to try to put a suture in this tiny little incision that I need. And just wipe the edges of it. Just in case there's any cyst wall on that. Make sure I'm not putting it back. This area, I'm going to look at it real quick. Just double check around. We went to this last year, I think it was. We went to Africa. Oh, that's because fun. Because we were supposed to go a couple of years before, but COVID got in the way. Mm -hmm. And that was amazing. I like. Yeah, Michael and I did that for his. Oh, you've done that? I think it's for his 40th. It's so good. Yeah, so it is. It's fun to do safari. Yeah. Just like it really makes I feel like it humbles you. Mm hmm. Yep. To hold a different world, you know? A whole different world That's there. So true. Okay, so you're gonna have a top.
top stitch. I'm just gonna put the one underneath. Let's see if it'll pull together. Can you put this right here? So I only have enough space to put one stitch underneath, okay? Those are the stitches that dissolve and I usually try to put in two whenever I can because then if for some reason one were to break under tension, you know, mm -hmm. that the other one would still be there, but I can't here, but just because of space, it's not possible. But those are like the most important stitch because it holds the edges together over a longer term. Mm -hmm. But like I said, on the chest with the high stretch and pull, just make sure to try not to do, don't try to do some crazy yoga moves or anything. <laughs> you know what I mean? At this point here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put, I don't even think I can put like, I can't put um, the plastic surgery cut stitch because it's only gonna be literally two stitches here. It's not enough space. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make sure, make sure you take, have somebody take off the top two stitches mm -hmm. in one week. Okay. So we don't have a little track mark across there. <clears throat> and then still you have a stitch underneath, but I want to keep it as tight as t I can. So I would say, please, like if you have stair strips or band-aid, put it across horizontal on chest so it pulls okay. the edges together a little more, you know? Okay. For like the next, I would say week or so after that even. So next Wednesday, take out the stitch. Take out the two blue ones on top. Okay. And then stair strips after that. Yes, week. yeah. Or as long as you can or you want to, you know? The longer the better to keep it, give it strength. The, those sutures underneath take about six to eight weeks to absorb. Well, that's a long time. Do you want more popping action? The first look at new videos and exclusive access to my full library of videos. Click the join button below to learn more about channel memberships.